Hello guys, my name is Stevie and I'm gonna show you how to make this very famous very famous Yahoo Smiley and yeah, this Smiley is from the old version of Yahoo Messenger and so let's get started make a new file uh, these are my dimensions and click OK. Now we we'll start. We will start to build a background. So double click on background and click OK. Now right click, blending options, and choose a gradient. I'm gonna choose mm, blue. Blue, make it a radial, reverse. Yep, the this I used um, pink, and now I'm gonna use blue. I don't know why. So, what you're gonna do is grab a, a ellipse tool, make a new layer, and just hold shift and uh, make a circle pretty big I guess position it and right click on it and rest tries or something like that and now what you can do is right click on it and choose blending options now Mm, let's select drop shadow okay opacity to 100 and size to 0 is it good? Mm, yeah now oh. Oh, oh, oh I forgot to put the colors you, you see right here up the screen so I will know what colors to put in now again go back to the blending options we have already selected drop shadow now select gradient overlay blending mode normal opacity choose a style of radial and scale 100 now put the colors in this color is f seven a just read okay now the second color yep click OK okay and you have a basic face of our smiley now what you're gonna do is you wanna you wanna what you wanna duplicate that layer right click on it and duplicate okay uh, hide our effects by clicking the eye and just go to well no I did yeah go to edit transform scale and just scale it down a bit and with the arrow keys position it on the center like this now hold control and click on the that shape we just made you see the selection of that shape and just grab the rectangular or elliptical Maric tool this uh, move the selection right and down like this now hit delete on your keyboard and that will make the selection disappear what's inside the selection now go to select deselect and we have a that smiley now grab a rectangular Maric tool and just 
select a part of the moon you could say on the face below the half this is a half below the half you see maybe like this that should be good and again hit delete now I'm just gonna clear the guides now again with the Marik selection tool selected make a selection for the upper no down part of the moon and when you have that done right click on it and layer via cut and now what you, this will do will make the moon uh, in two pieces like one piece and second piece now select the first piece that's upper piece and then change opacity to around 80 <coughs> and select the second piece and change opacity to a half like 50 like yes now we're gonna start to build the eye so again ellipse tool make a new layer and hold shift to make a perfect circle like this now again right click and rest eyes and right click again but this time blending options select this color and click ok now position it up here and duplicate it right click on it and duplicate layer ok and just move it right uh, you can make your guides to see the half that's not so if this is half of the face we must position the eyes so they will be perfectly apart from each other or from the center like this now clear the guides and again elliptical maric tool or selection tool and make a selection with holding shift like this yeah it should be good and position it down down uh, make a rectangular maric tool and hold hold alt on your keyboard and just make a selection that will destroy you can say all the other selection now zoom in and make and again select a rectangle mark tool hold shift and just increase the mouth up a bit like so now go to an actual pixels for this one actual pixels and make a new layer fill it uh, edit fill with any color you want now go to select and deselect right click blending options and go to gradient overlay make a radial gradient scale 150 and just these two colors yep we're gonna have to reverse it like this like it like it pretty much like it now position it down a bit <clears throat> like so and uh, stroke three pick oh my mistake my mistake make uh, two pixels three two pixels and like an orange color or so and we're nearly at the end we just need to make teeth so 
again make a new layer and select rectangular marik tool zoom in and just make a rectangular for the teeth like this fill it with any color add it fill white and again actual pixels go to select and deselect now just uh, this is a straightforward process right click on it blending options go to gradient overlay and now go to radio no oh, linear and just change the angle to zero double click on the gradient editor choose this color like gray and move this white 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 thing to a location of 15 and click on the gray one and click below this gradient so it will make a new one and just um, pull pull it to the side again copy this white one click on it copy it and make it a location of 85 so yeah we have just finished the our smiley like you see in here uh, hope you enjoyed this tutorial subscribe like and comment I will do more Photoshop tutorials and yeah hope you enjoy bye